What's up YouTube? This is LDS Reliance. I am outside today working on a new project that I wanted to show you guys. Um, and I'll probably do a, a two or three part series on this on this particular build. Um, this may not look like much at this point. Uh, you probably have no idea what it is. But knowing me and knowing uh, how much I enjoy playing with solar, and you can obviously see a battery here, um, you may have guessed that this is going to be a, sol a portable generator. Um, so that's what this is going to be. It's going to be a solar powered uh, generator and um, it's going to have batteries, multiple batteries at some point, but one to start off with. Um, and I'm going to build this basically for portable emergency power. Um, I've, I've built the prototype and I actually am interested in potentially um, doing these commercially um, and they obviously won't be built out of wood they'll need to be uh, weatherproof and and a little bit more rugged but just for the the prototype to learn how I want everything set up and and everything like that um, I just used some scrap wood that I had laying around in the garage and built this box and uh, I built it so that it would be wide enough for uh, two of these batteries and we'll put a little uh, divider in there to kind of hold the batteries so they don't slide around We'll build a little uh, handle, uh, kind of almost like a wagon on the front, so you can pick it up and move it around. It's actually, even with the battery in it, which is very heavy, um, with these big wheels, it's actually really maneuverable and not that bad for uh, even a, a kid could move this thing around. And then uh, I've done a couple reviews on this, uh, or a couple videos on this recently, this Lensun 100 watt solar panel. This is going to be the panel that will power this. So we'll build some sort of a, a top a lid that uh, on some hinges that will support uh, this panel. And basically I can just wheel this somewhere, lay it down uh, on the ground and be charging up the batteries and storing power for whatever I need. Um, inside on this side will be some electronics. Obviously you're gonna, we're gonna need a charge controller, we're gonna need an inverter, uh, we're gonna need um, some safety equipment and some things like that and then <clears throat> on one of the sides I haven't really figured out where but we'll we'll po poke some holes and put uh, um, some receptacles some some 110 volt receptacles coming from the inverter that will uh, that we can just plug in uh, without having to open the lid or anything like that so uh, obviously there are other uh, of these on the market I have some ideas in the future of things that can differentiate this from other offerings that are on the market um, and and really make this really pretty cool and, and kind of pushing the envelope of technology. Um, I'm exploring some new battery technologies that could make this smaller, lighter weight, faster charging, things like that. So anyway, I just wanted to show you guys the, the kind of the, the baseline here of, of what we're working with. And uh, I haven't come up with a complete parts list or anything like that, but stay tuned. This is just the first uh, introduction. And uh, the next part, we'll go ahead and get the battery in, put in a divider, and start mounting the electronics inside. Stay tuned. Thanks for watching, guys.